So I caused my own problems. And the reason I caused my own problems because I think that things should be the way I like them to be. Case in point, you know, there's a couple co-workers. I felt like we was cool, man. We done had a couple, uh, we've been working around each other for a while. We done had a couple of close conversations. So I'm expecting them to be like, you know, my friend. And I'm expecting them to treat me the way I would treat them. Case in point, I had a little situation, you know, where a nigga worked overtime. Like, I worked past my shift. I worked, you know, pretty much past 16. You supposed to get out of at 16. That's even the head or there. So what I would have done was I would have relieved somebody, especially if I'm going to be there, you know, for eight more hours, then this person got to need to go because they've been here past 16, right? I would relieve them and be like, yo, man, get lost. But, you know, I had some people who I felt like, you know, we was better than this, you know, just refused to take keys because they was mad that my relief is always late. So let me get this straight. You going to punish me, make me stay to try to prove a point to somebody that don't even know or don't even care? Really? This is how you get down? Really sway. So anyway, and I was a little distraught. I was a little hurt because I feel like we was better than that. Because I would never do my worst enemy like that, especially if I'm going to be here. You know, man, go on, I got, bro. I'm going to be here for eight. Go on, uh, shoot out. You know, but I learned a valuable lesson. You know, majority of the time, your coworkers are just your coworkers. It's very little. Very minute when you're gonna meet somebody that you really vibe with for real, for real on your job. So, this video is to let y'all know from now on in life with other people, bro, I know what it is. And I'm gonna keep you on your lane. I ain't gonna try to put you in the fast lane because that ain't where you drive. You drive in the regular lane. You drive the speed limit, bro. And guess what? I can't be mad at you. I can only be mad at myself for expecting you to change the lane and drive the left lane. So I want to thank y'all for letting me know what it is. And I'll act accordingly. Now, mind, be mindful that none of this is personal. I just understand what it is. I ain't mad at you. I ain't going to treat you no type of way, bro. It just is what it is. Amen. So I thank y'all for being you. Thank you for not being a friend.